Well, the thing fun. is, it's easy to forget. You look at your life online and, you know, the things that you've done for Giovanni, thing, you, know, you put blokes to shame all <laughs> over the world. <laughs> that, was, that was so much easier than doing a speech. I like seeing that's just what I do for a living. Mm. So I, I think I just so got good. got away with it. I mean, we try, I think we try and have a balance. You know, we do share our fails online. Yeah, when you put it all together and it looks, you know, very kind of happy and, and magical. There are obviously yeah. stressful times. But then if you look at your phone, like you'll have taken photos of the nice times. Mm -hmm. And yeah. that's what you share. No, absolutely. You know? Absolutely. And actually this book, because this is this is your book, Jibba. Yep. Oh, uh, and it says Happy Baby, a Happy Mum is what it's called. And really with all the blogging, this was a real natural progression mm -hmm. of that for you. And yeah. to put everything down in here. And you say this isn't this isn't preachy and this isn't a guide of how to bring no. up your baby. It's that wasn't what it was meant to be at all. No, because I think there's there, there's so much stuff out there that tells us how to be the perfect mum and actually it's not that easy we, and straight away we kind of feel like there is a way to parent and there's a right way and you're always doing it wrong and you feel like you're the only one getting it wrong all the time I, I allowed myself to just write and share and at the end of it I could go I don't want to share that let's take that out and actually I kept everything in mm. yeah. some really in. very personal bits that you haven't spoken about no before. no I I, uh, I talk about uh, PCOS and miscarriage um, and I didn't tell Tom that I was uh, going to be writing about it until uh, I, I let him read it. <laughs> it was the first kind of chunk that I wrote, because I wanted to start right at the beginning about my dreams and aspirations of being a mum. I thought I was going to be like Maria in Sound of Music, you know, making curtains out of... No, clothes out of curtains and yeah. all of that. Uh, and it just... Um, yeah, it just didn't happen like that. It didn't, it didn't come easily. And um, So I showed Tom that uh, that section without telling him what it was because I didn't want him to start reading it and thinking like, already having thoughts and feelings yeah. about it so yeah. just to see what he made of it and, and what did you make of it well, I cried for a <laughs> long time yeah. <laughs> no it's um I think it's so important to be honest and yeah. sh sharing is so important and with parenthood and there's so much that I didn't know about before we became parents and it's only now realising that the most important thing is just sharing information yeah. and it's stuff that it's, it is uncomfortable talking about but it's so important because that's how we learn that yeah. okay it's not just us it's not just me other people feel like this or this or just knowing what happens especially for a woman physically there's a lot of stuff that's pretty oh, uncomfortable I do talking share a about lot. <laughs> you do? yeah but it's, yeah. it's so important so how, how else do you know that kind of stuff yeah, unless someone really is important. you know is brave enough to be honest and share it and um, so I was, you know, I was obviously it's difficult when it's about you um, or about us, um, but I do, you know, it's, um, you know, totally admire it and um, it's... Yeah. Uh, yeah. yeah, I could have taken the miscarriage out but uh, and, and the PCOS, but I thought sharing it on a platform that's completely me, it's completely safe, it's completely my own words, um, I've not, it's not been edited down into something else and, you know, made into headlines or whatever, it, it's, this is the complete story. Yeah, and you can control it because it's yours. Yeah, it's and it, I think that was really important. It should be. Um, you also go into there's a whole little bit in there about body image mm -hmm. as well, and how you sort of felt before the baby and how you felt after the baby, and that's something that a lot of women go through. Yeah, definitely. And I do think actually my miscarriage has kind of had a part in that as well. Uh, after Buddy arrived. Uh, we had this thing where a lady kind of looked at me and pointed and was like, oh, mummy's still got her tummy, and laughed at me. Uh, and then she was asking Tom for fo a photo at the time, um, and then she asked me to be in it, and I declined, and she said, oh, no, maybe next time when your face is slimmed down. <gasps> Uh, so oh there was a whole gosh. big thing, yeah. Uh, and so a couple of times. What do you say in, when we're somebody... in A and E at the I've time? I've never said that. Oh, I've sorry. never said that. <laughs> <laughs> it was, we're in A and E at the time, and it was somebody who worked there who said it. Who should have been really looking in a, after in us? Who should have been looking after us? You know, it was just a bit. Um, it was oh, a bit that's stressful. Awful. And, and, and so, but as a result of that, I was uh, looking at myself in the mirror a couple of days later, and I was just like, "How do I feel about this? I've knocked my body, and I literally have knocked my body since I was about nine years old. I can remember being on Frinton Beach, seeing stretch marks on my thighs, and I've just." nitpicked to every single thing and, and torn it apart and I just thought how do I feel about it now it's not like it was when I was 18 it's changed a lot my boobs are doing this I'm like you know wobbly and all sorts and I just thought actually it's amazing it's given me two children I, I, I was so angry with my body when I had a miscarriage that it to, I felt, felt that it failed me I hated it and that, at that point looking at my body I was like it's it's completely done me a great yeah. service and I should be And you've, you've been very proud, you posted pictures yeah, shared yeah, by had, Ashton Kutcher. I, I know, totally. <laughs> I'll tell you about that. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, I don't. She talks about that quite a lot. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> she reminds me of that. How hands-on uh, yeah. hands are you? Well, as a dad, I'm, well, I'm, I'm, all, I, I all would the say time. 50 /50 I'm daddy honest. daycare at the moment. She's are on you? book tour. I'm at home with the, are the kids. Are you? Not now, obviously. But...